Hello again. So today I have for you another Timu haul. This is my second Timu haul ever. And today I got lots of hair pieces, a couple wigs, and shoes again. <laughs> so I'm going to begin with the shoes. All right, so I purchased these shoes again. And this time I bought them in a smaller size. So these are, uh, it says European size 38. EUR38 and this is what they look like. I have bought this in the previous haul but they were way too big on me so I gave them to my husband but I like these shoes so much and he really likes them. He's always wearing them so uh, I decided to get some smaller ones for myself. I wanted some that were half a size larger than these but they did not have them so I decided to go with the 38 and i think that they are a bit snug so they do fit but i could not wear them with like regular socks i would have to wear the really thin socks for them to fit and then maybe like as i wear them they're gonna stretch out a little bit i feel like it's very hit and miss with shoe sizes the next item is this one right here and these are bangs <laughs> This really looks like real hair. Honestly, like it really looks like real hair that has been straightened. And then the back, it looks like this. So it has like a tiny little comb or a barrette. And then it has like this little piece of lace on it. As you can see right here. There you go. Now, I don't know how to put on bangs, like fake bangs. I feel like putting in bobby pins would be like the best idea just because it'll hold it'll hold it in place a lot better but you get the idea of these um that's what they're supposed to look like <laughs> like this it does have like the longer ones on the sides so it looks a little bit more like natural so if you pull your hair back see my hairline is a little bit strange but if you put your hair up then it still looks like you have like these things on the sides i think this is cute if you want to find out how bangs will look on you but then again like for example my hair is wavy so when i've had bangs when i was like 12 years old i had bangs and they did not look straight like this unless i straightened them they were wavy they did not look like this at all <laughs> And back in those days, because it was in the 90s, um, the bangs wouldn't look like this. The bangs would actually go up like that and we would put hairspray. Kind of like in There's Something About Mary. That's what we did back in the, back in the 90s, like mid 90s. So this next item is this little piece right here that's kind of like tussled a tussle bun hair updo so it's supposed to be kind of like the one of those romantic wedding updos <laughs> like a very bridal thing now this one is a little too brown i feel for my hair but um let me show you all right so this is my hair my my bun right here with nothing on it this is like a donut basically so you just stick your hand through it because it's just like a donut it's like a ring and then what I do is just put it on there like that. See? And this is what it ends up looking like. I haven't seen it on, like on camera, so I don't know if it's going to match my hair color or not. But that's the idea. So if you want it to look a little bit less obvious, you could always um, style it so that you don't see your bun and you just put bobby pins on it so you don't see the actual bun of your natural hair and all you see is like this and i think that that will look a little bit more uh, natural but this hair this synthetic hair looks so natural that i i mean i don't think that if i saw somebody wearing this out in public i wouldn't tell that it wasn't their hair <laughs> i could not tell you could always put it upside down and kind of have like one of those messy bun situations like this. 
why not? <laughs> but I don't think that that's, uh, that's the idea. The idea is to put the, the longer part like on the bottom. So the next hair piece is this one right here. And I tried yesterday putting it on. It looks like this. So it is a very long ponytail. And then it has Velcro and it also has this thing right here, like these clips and the lace, it's on lace right there. And it is like a brown, beautiful, long brown ponytail. I just got it dirty right now. It's very straight. And the idea is to wrap it around your bun and then you're gonna wrap that around and then you're gonna wrap this piece around that bun so that you can't tell that it's not real <laughs> all right so let's see so this is what i'm doing you can see i mean i don't know if i'm making a mess or not because i can't see it but i think that this is kind of like the idea <laughs> and then you go ahead and you grab this thing at the top with a bobby pin, which I don't have right here, so I'm gonna put a clip right here um, that you're gonna be able to see. I think this is the idea right here. How does it look? Like I can't see myself in the back, so I can't tell. But yeah, that's, um, <laughs> that's the idea. And it does reach my waist. Like it keeps going down. It's very long. So it, it, it reaches my butt. Uh, but yeah, that's the idea of this tail uh, ponytail. And I think that if you do this correctly, and I think maybe if you have somebody else do it for you, it will look so much better and more like real. And you have to make sure that it matches your natural hair color, or at least the color you have on your hair at the moment so that um, it looks a little bit more real. And then you could always like do pictures, you know, take pictures with your hair kind of like this. Like, oh, have you seen my beautiful long mane? <laughs> you know, Instagram. <laughs> For your Instagram, Facebook pictures, Snapchat, whatever it is, you know, you could always just like, put it to the front like this to look like you're doing whatever or you could like do a video and you're just like playing with your hair like and people are like wow look at that beautiful thick ponytail <laughs> so next I have this wig right here and it is kind of like a medium length wig with bangs and it's blue it does have like this lace underneath the top has this, I don't know what it is. And then it does have the straps down here so that you could tighten it a little bit if you need to. This is what it looks like on. And you can see that it's a very, very like dark blue, but at the same time, it's like kind of vivid. In certain lighting, it kind of looks a little bit darker, kind of like a black with a blue highlight to it. But then in other lighting, uh, it looks a little bit more like blue. And it is so pretty. It does look like real hair as well, like except like really shiny. But it does feel like real straight hair. You can see that it is such a pretty wig. It is like very um, natural looking. Obviously, like nobody has blue hair uh, in naturally <laughs> but it could be a person that has natural hair that has dyed it this shade so i love it i think like wigs are so much fun the bangs are a little bit long i do have a very short forehead so if you have like a normal forehead they're gonna be a little bit higher on you <laughs> let me show you the back i would consider this i do consider this a shorter type of wig um, it's not short it's kind of like medium short to medium this is the other wig okay, so I got this wig because I was looking for something that kind of looks like bloom from the Winx Club um, 
I was like going back and forth between a, one that was a little bit lighter than this one and another one that was a little bit more red. And I ended up picking this one and I think it is super duper cute. It's cute and it's long. Let me show you the back. The back goes right up, like right on my butt, like on the upper part of my butt. Now I am petite, I'm pretty short. Um, so, I don't know, it might be a little bit shorter on you, but on me, it reaches the, it goes below my waist. I feel like it has like enough hair to like look a little bit natural. Now you would definitely have to like do something like in the back right here uh, to flatten your hair. Not like me that I have a bun underneath and it's like so obvious. It is such a cute color. Um, I don't think this color looks right on me. I, I look like it doesn't go. I think especially because my, my eyebrows are very black. <laughs> Nevertheless, I think that it's just a really pretty color and it really pops with this blue dress. <laughs> all right so again this one also feels very natural but it's like shiny and matte at the same time this reminds me of victoria from twilight i think she was the second act actress to play the part um yeah that she had kind of like ginger hair so yeah that's what this reminds me of and i think that it's so cute <laughs> all right so that was my haul for today I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know which one was your favorite items out of all of these. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and stay safe out there. Bye.